Hey, hey, back at you here Monday morning on the job site. We got stuff going on around here. Let me show you what we have happening here today. So today is time to dig out for this pool. Here is our dig sheet. It's an R32 from River Pools. It is 15 by 32. The bottom end here is a uh, six foot. Sloping up to three foot eight inches on the shallow end. We've got some nice benches and steps here on this corner, and it's going right in here. We got the truck here, we got the big hoe here. We're gonna dig this thing out, get our stone in there, and the pool is showing up on Wednesday. So that's the plan. Hopefully, Wednesday afternoon, Thursday, we'll have this thing full of water. Um, so it's moving right along. Got Stretch over here, he is sick of flexing. Making these joints look amazing. Good job there, Stretch. That looks amazing. Keep it up, man. Dustin's over here, he's just eating cookies. That's pretty much all he's been doing here. Do you want one? Oh yeah, I'll take one. All right, well, we are going to start moving some dirt. Hey, good morning, how y'all doing? at um, one o'clock or so. The pool is gonna show up right in here. we we'll use the track of the big one to uh, swing it straight off of there and straight into the hole. So that's gonna be an easy one right there. We got Stretch. He is our sick of flex specialist over there. He's getting her done, making the joints look amazing. We got Dustin over here. And we are getting ready to throw in some natural stone. Black Hill steps up through there. Then there'll be a little walkway that leads over to those front steps over there. So that's what we got rolling. These steps are a beautiful product to work with. They actually come from Missouri, but they make a, a great staircase. So that's what we got going. Hey, uh, Dustin, remember we're gonna put conduit behind there? Yep. Okay, remember that? All right. Awesome. Our uh, working quarters here is getting a little bit tight. I guess we got too many machines. But after the day, we'll be able to get that big guy out of here and uh, give us a little more room. Yeah, looking forward to it. Pull in here and hopefully we'll be able to get some water in there uh, yet today. And right there you have it. Just like that, we have a pole in the ground. Just a matter of making sure it's the right spot and we're good. Hey, Matt coming to you. Hope you're having a great day. It's a bright, hot day here on the job site. Got the hat on. It's like my own personal shade tree, so it is. The pool is in. We decided to plumb this one after we had it in the hole. Typically, we would plumb it before, but uh, we did it after it was in the hole. The skimmer's in. Got all of our lines in there, they're zip tied fast. That helps support those lines and never allows them to get pulled down and break off uh, fittings, which would be a problem. So Jeff's over there running some plumbing. Um, we got three lights in here. That's a return, that's a light, that's return. Then there's two lights on this side right here. Over here, we are working in some natural stone steps. It's what me and Stretch have been working on the last little while. Got some boulders going in there. Some nice steps arching up around here. And then there'll be some pavers running from here over to the other set of steps coming down. It's coming right along. Tomorrow we're gonna get some more water in here and uh, finish backfilling. Good morning, Matt coming to you. How y'all doing this morning? So we are on the job site here today. And I wanna show you what we got going on around here. We're making some progress. Yeah, the end's in sight here. So the other, uh, last week we got this all kind of graded out. Got some dirty behind the wall for some landscape. Some planting's going in there. This over here is done. We got our easy joint installed. It's great product. So the upper area here is completed. Happy with that. And it looks like they're getting ready to run some machines. Got to make a noise down there? All right, the pulls in. We got our concrete collar around the top. That'll get covered with a uh, York cap, the same stuff that's on that wall. But today, we are going to be bringing our uh, two-way modified basin here. We're gonna get that compacted in, in all these areas. 
And the one thing about uh, pools is you got to make sure, well, really any any patio, but you always got to make sure your water is draining away from the pool. Um, so in this case, the water comes out to this line, and then it slopes up back towards that wall. So what we're going to do is uh, put in a paper drain, and that's what this pipe is for. Once our base is in there, we'll cut this pipe off to the appropriate height, and we'll be able to set a slit drain right down through where that orange uh, mark is. So. That's the plan there. Got some conduit in here for uh, running some wire through here. And uh, so yeah, it's coming along. Hopefully by the end of this week, we should be getting real close to uh, being done with the pavers. Getting ready to lay some papers, so let me what we have going here. So we got all of our cap mortared down, and that got mortared on top of our concrete collar. So that's all done. We're uh, getting ready to lay some papers in this area right here. A couple things here. This area actually uh, slopes from the pool coming out down to this center line right here. And then it goes back up to the wall. And we're gonna lay all these pavers in, and then we're going to cut in a two inch wide, two and three eighth inch deep paver drain. It's made for pavers the same thickness, so it's really convenient for that. So we got it all screwed out. That way, when it rains, we don't have water standing on a patio. Right there is the drain, and we'll just slide our bottom out drain right into that. It'll drain down through there. That ties into this drain here, which there's gonna be a drain along the back side of this wall. So that way I'll catch all the water coming in this direction. So that's what we got going. It's looking good and uh, it's getting ready to look even better here. So we're gonna get rolling on this now. Good morning to you guys. We are back on the job site. Yesterday, we kind of got rained out. So I had to deal with a lot of mud. Always makes it a challenge when you're trying to finish up the project, you know, get things cleaned up and then you're dragging mud everywhere. So I had to call it off there yesterday about half a day. But back on the job site this morning and things are moving right along. Planning on uh, wrapping this project up. Not today, but Monday. So pool's looking amazing. We got a little robotic cleaner down there doing a fantastic job. Shining things up for us. Fences in, we're getting all of our lighting hooked up. All the plants are pretty much done. So today, we're gonna finish our lighting, finish a little bit of planting, and do some mulching. All these uh, plants and mulch and lighting is a little bit like the icing on the cake. So really makes the project pop out. So that's what we got going. y'all doing folks it's monday we are back on our job site here in saxton and today's a good day it is uh 11 o'clock ish and we are done wrapped up all the details taken care of the uh, lawn's been seated pretty much just packing up equipment and heading out of here so i'm gonna give you a little uh walk through here final walk through all right well the homeowners are moving some furniture on out here which is great i always love seeing people using what we create so let me just walk you around all the fencing's up did a great job on that got some handrails on here gate leading into the pool area got some stepping stones running over that way to uh just for access out that direction these black hills natural stone steps are absolutely uh fantastic looking for sure so it turned out uh amazing Cast in wall from E.P. Henry. We got some blue 60 um, pavers here from 
Peco block. So all in all, the project went well and uh, turned out well. Homeowners are happy, which is what we want. Hopefully, hopefully y'all enjoyed watching this. Uh, the progress on this uh, job site it was maybe three weeks ago. That there was just grass back here, so uh, it's amazing what can happen in three weeks. So, all right, folks, I hope you enjoyed watching this project come together. And as always, thanks for watching. Have a great day, and we'll see you on the next project.